Gladys Vandell, my given name. And my hider name is Jika, and I belong to the Skittigit Giddens. And our clan name is Na Ewan's Kairga. And I'm Irene Mills, and my name is Jaka Hilta. And I'm also Skittigit Giddens. When I first started learning, which was in 1994, the, the only one that was interested in learning then, and Dolores Churchill came from Alaska, she's massive, but she, she let me know that she was coming, and I was the only one that was interested in learning. And I just feel that it's my ancestors pushing me out there, just like my sister is always doing to me, you know, get out there. And she's always pushing me out to make a speech. Dolores asked me, what do you want to learn to weave? And I said, a hat. And usually that's... I don't think that's the first thing you teach, but I did learn to weave a hat. And I wove for about, I think, four years, and then I asked permission if I could start teaching. And she was thrilled that I was willing to teach. I think after the, the teaching that Dolores did, her daughter April, also came home and did some weaving workshops and I took my kids out of school for a week so they could attend April's class mm -hmm. and since those two ladies came home to teach weaving we have more weaving done now because of those teachings that were brought and as hats were done and baskets were done and people were able to start experimenting with different styles and bringing our traditional ways into a new form of art which you'll see with the fedoras that Auntie did for both Uncle Al, uh, her husband and her grandson Josh and a lot of weavers started experimenting with the different ways of weaving which I think just goes to show how innovation and how people that are inspired can move things from a time long ago into a more current and relevant way of, of working with the materials. I think the most important thing is to always um, respect the person that has taught you. You always have to um, mention her name because you never learned it yourself. If it wasn't for Dolores, I wouldn't have been weaving now, probably and her daughters, but they taught me well, so, and from that I like to share, and 